There's a. Uh, oh, can I dive? Ooh, I can. To oh, I totally dived. Nice. At uh, at forty, you get a gold rupee, which is three hundred. Uh, at fifty, oh, okay, you get a giant's wallet. Wow, we're in. Uh, uh, what's it called? Uh, uh, Elden Doom. Elden oh. volcano. Master, this is the Elden volcano. It is in. Okay, well, I'll just uh, skip my own dialogue then. She like skips ahead. Maybe that's part of the quality of life uh, features where, like, you don't have to manly push A for fee every time. Uh, 65% of the region is covered by lava. This can happen to a large number of creatures that thrive in extreme heat. No, no, no. Uh, please exercise caution with flammable materials such as wood and fabric. Huh. Uh, in the event you catch on fire, I highly recommend you extinguish the flames by performing a forward roll or a spin attack. Alrighty. Yeah, and this is a big place, actually. Yeah. Um, oh, then when you get 50, you get the giant's wallet. And then when you get 70, you get two gold rupees. Which Ooh. is 600 rupees total. Yeah. And then at 80, you get the tycoon wallet. Okay, so that's just like an even bigger wallet then. Yes. Okay. Uh, oh, we got a lava chew jelly. Ah, oh. even though they're not called chew jellies. Uh, okay, I got a goddess cube. Right here. Okay. Um, which way to go? I'm assuming that. That way's gonna be the main path, but I want to see what's over here. Okay. Um. Ah, okay. A bombable wall. I don't have any bombs yet. Holy shit. Oh, did you see some spoilers? No, no, just like how much, how many rupees the tycoon wallet holds. How much does it hold? 9,000 rupees. <laughs> That's a lot. What, and is that like the Skyward Sword HD walkthrough? Um, just the Skyward Sword, just the original one, I guess. Hmm. Oh, but it, it it's it says the same thing as that other wiki did. Master, I require your confirmation. You are currently attempting to ascertain the location of Zelda. Are you familiar with how to use Dowsing? Of course, yes. Shut up. It's like no, I forgot. Of course you do. My apologies. Please continue your search for Zelda. Like I hardly even use it. I'm fine. I'll so uh down there. Sure. Oh, what's this? The hell are these motherfuckers? Hey, hey, hey! I'm digging here. You mess with our turf and you're gonna pay? Hey Tana. <laughs> wow, you're not. Yo, Led, I didn't think this is one of those red creeps. <laughs> Whoa! You're not. Yo, Led, I don't think this is one of those red creeps. Looks uh, like his mother. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, I think you're right. No reason to scare the hay off us, so. Sorry about that, pal. These monsters showing up and messing with our turf are scummy on edge. They show up here, and I'm gonna knock the red clean out of them. That's what I'm doing here. Yeah, me and Led. Me, Led. <laughs> That's my music. Yeah, whatever. Me too scared to dig in the dark. Anyway, if you're looking for treasure, you should stay clear of those red guys. Uh, I'm not gonna steer clear of those red guys. Hey, Tana. Uh, should I? We should kill those red guys. Ah, uh, you're looking- they carrying treasure, huh? Ah, uh, you're looking for a friend? Not treasure? So that must have been your pal that passed by earlier. Sprinting by without so much as a glance in this direction. It was sort of a blur of mo movement. So I didn't get a real good look, but I knew it wasn't one of those red creeps. Your pal must have gone straight up here, so why don't you follow? Really? Zelda doing a Naruto run? <laughs> She's like... <laughs> you like look up on the mountain. She's like running up the... <laughs> yeah, with her like, arms. Like running straight up the freaking mountain. Someone actually did that when people were raiding Area 51. Yeah, I saw it in the newscast. Yeah. Oh gosh, this is spectacular. The one that went running through here looked uh, look kind of like you. I don't think he was dressed in green, though. Hmm. Cool. That was what I was hoping to hear. And there is something down there. Ooh, Ruby. yes. 
I'm gonna gently... Ooh, okay, alright, cool. Totally worth it. Yep. Okay. Um, uh, excuse me. Okay. So, speaking of that Area 51 raid or whatever. Yeah. So people were talking about, like, oh yeah, they can't, like, with all of us there, they can't shoot all of us. Actually, yes, yes, they can. It, and, like, on a... Huh? Ooh. Okay. What the hell was that, Rupee? You didn't get anything. Oh, yeah, I did. I, uh, I swiped it. Yeah, but, but, like... I did. Huh. I, I can uh, grab stuff with my sword. Yeah. But like you can do in most Zelda games. It didn't look like the, uh, like, your counter went up. Yeah, I did. Like, I had, like, what, three rupees, and then I picked up 20, and then I picked up a blue and a green one. So oh. that's six. So three to 20. Uh, 23, and then to uh, 26. Interesting. Well, yeah, I, I picked it up. Aww. Ah! Who are you supposed to be? Never seen your mug around here before. Oh, hold it right there! Are you a friend of those red creeps? Pfft, no way. You're not, huh? Well, you don't like, look like them, that's for sure. I love how You're Death not Mountain. that ugly. I love how Death Mountain just became, like, like, Jersey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that's uh, what I pictured these guys. Uh, like, uh, just the dialogue that I remember, or, or just the way uh, they talk, is, they just seem kind of like, you, you, you know, yeah. like someone from New Jersey. Like, uh -huh. hey, I'm walking here! So what then? You here to pick up bomb flowers? Bomb what? Bomb flowers! I would love bomb flowers. You're they joking, would look great right? with my walls. You're joking, right? Those are, are them growing right over there. You pick one up with they, and then the fuse lights. A few seconds later, boom! You don't want to stop and sniff this flower. Dangerous plants, believe me. But once you learn how to use them, they're a powerful weapon. Us magmas are crazy about them. You can toss and roll them the same way you do jars. See what you can do with those bomb flowers over there. Um, huh? You do know how to roll and throw stuff, right? Not really. I'm a dumbass. <laughs> Don't know any of this stuff? Huh? No worries, pal. I got you covered with all the info you need. When you've got a bomb flower, hold it up. The trajectory of the bomb will show you up for you. So all you do is line up with your target and chuck it. A trajectory guide will also show up if you hold it down low. Then you can roll the bomb along that guideline. Uh, to reach places high uh, up high, it's best to throw bombs, but to cover distances or pass through narrow spaces, rolling is definitely the way to go. Okay. So, uh, I'm just gonna look at their house. Ooh, some bugs. I'm just gonna... You got two of them. Yeah. That's awesome. Volcanic ladybugs. Aren't there, like, bugs that are, like, heat resistant? Um... I don't know if there's some like like on the surface, but I do know like like deep in the ocean, yes. There's entire ecosystems built around those geothermic vents, things like that. Oh yeah, break those pots. There was nothing in them. It wasn't more of it. Uh, okay, so again, using motion controls. Nice. At least when bowling with it. Oh yeah, by the way, um, so I'm using a different pair of Joy-Cons this time. It's, uh, like, a dark blue and, uh, a neon yellow. I just uh -huh. want to see if, like, the colors of the Joy-Cons also showed up in the UI of this game. Do they? Uh, that doesn't seem to be the case. It's just your typical red and blue. Nice throw. Thank you. Yeah, rupees! Yeah, so I guess, like, the blue and red Joy-Cons are just a default for this. Oh, okay. Wh which is okay. And then, ooh, okay. There's, uh, something in here. Oh, oh, I can curve it, I can curve it! That's cool. Yeah, I'll just, uh, grab this. Back my ass out of here. Basically, you can't turn around in there. Nope. Um... That looks like an important path. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna go... Blow up this wall. Whoa! It's like okay. a gigantic chew. Hold on, can I, uh... Blow it up. Wow. 
Wow, that was highly effective. And uh, underwhelming. I was hoping to get some weapons out of yeah. or or some materials out of that. Just something. Well, at, le at least it's effective. Yeah, it did the job. It's super effective. Why, how much, really? <laughs> okay. Speaking of that, have you played any Pokemon Snap? Oh, the new one? Yeah. I have not. I have Me not either. bought the game. Me either. I don't know. I... The next Pokemon game I'm probably going to play is going to be... Uh... Uh, the Brilliant Diamond, Shiny yeah. Pearl. Yeah, it's like, well, I'll just play the main series and call it good. Hey, I'm not a stranger. And you're not one of those red creeps either. I swear this neighborhood's getting crummier every day. Huh? Oh, nothing. Just talking to myself. Hey, I saw this funny dress character go into that hole over there. It might be the friend you're looking for. You want to know what this cook was wearing? Let's see. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the getup was blackish. Other than that, I don't remember much. Uh. I don't think we've seen anyone dressed in black. Yeah, we have. Who? The, uh, last boss. No, he was dressed in red and white. Oh, I guess he was, wasn't he? Yeah. Hmm. Big. I don't know. What are you, the, the washmaster guy? That's what I was guy? Oh, look, there's a mini person. Oh. Oh no, that's a beetle. I thought it was like a little person, like a, like a teeny tiny uh, little guy. Come on, get it, get it. Oh shit, he just decided to die instead. Uh, I won't be part of a collection. <laughs> what do I have to do? Just like, hit with a sword first? Maybe? It's kind of weird that I have to hit these bugs with a sword. He was definitely rolling around a ball of shit though, so I don't know. Oh, I can actually crawl faster. There's like a little stamina gauge on the top right. Okay, that's actually good to know. And um, then got another... Got his cube. Okay, alright. Man, my throat's just like dying right now. Um, you need some Mountain Dew. Video my fish is breath you my man. Uh you know, preferably in the morning. I would just rather stick with Coca-Cola. Oh, I see. I I don't see myself like drinking Mountain Dew in the morning. I think that's just too much. Okay, I actually have to pick up that the fuck piece is of that guy. Um if I could tell us. Looks like a bitch. Just kidding. <laughs> so look. It won't let me cross here. So here's what I gotta do. I've got to... Oh, no. Okay, it's gotta be... I gotta be way, way in there. Nope. Thought you had a curve on it. Yeah. Or at least... Okay. Skyward Sword as bomb bowling. You got him. Yeah, I got that bitch. <laughs> got you, bitch. Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't, fucker. Aw. Oh. Trying it. To... You guys got a creepy freaking laugh. Yeah. Oh. Ow. Uh. Okay. Well, that's done. Oh, so I, I was telling you earlier about that VR stuff. So I'm trying to, I'm trying to figure out what. Other oh games, yeah, I don't think like, we've mentioned on uh, this show yet. Oh yeah, so uh, I, uh, so, I re recently got an Oculus Quest Two. Yeah, uh, Ezra showed it to me last night, and just before we started recording this game. It came in yesterday, so I was just getting it set up and everything, and uh, I was having a lot of fun with it, like kind of testing it out. Oh, he did. Well, well, don't let but, my bomb throwing like interrupt your VR. Oh no! But like, so uh, it was so stinking cool because I was watching uh, like, so I mean, I I downloaded Beat Saber because that's the one that Caleb wanted. So I got so I got that put on there. He he really wanted that one. 
Um, I, I'm debating whether I want to get a Star Wars game or a shooting game. For me. Right. Like, something like that. But, oh my gosh, it was so cool. I was, I was telling Tanner, you set up your own safe area, like, in your living room. Like, a line that you don't cross. Like, you can walk around as long as you stay within, like, your confines there. Like, the game, the headset, like, automatically tells you where you are. Like, oh gosh, I was, like, I was very impressed. And, I mean, I had to link my uh, Facebook account to it. So, not terribly enthusiastic about that. But, but, what? But, cheeks, cheeks, but, holes. Just kidding. No, so, but it was like so stinking cool. I was just like blown away at how like advanced it was. Like how like lightweight, compact, the whole thing. Like, I, I'm impressed. So, like, because for a long time, I didn't think, uh, as far as, like, viable gaming options go, like, I, I'm not a true believer in VR yet, right? Because you I, haven't I, messed I, with I, it that much. Yeah, I, I, ne I never really was. And so now, though, after I see this, it's like, okay. This is the shit. Right, like, this is cool. Oh, really? You're gonna make me come down? Okay, well, oh! Oh, okay. All right, I save. All right, but that, but yeah, I'm a true believer now. I mean, just how clear the picture is. I mean, if I, I could, uh, I'd have to like log in and do all that, but like I could put my Netflix on there and just watch Netflix in VR. <sighs> I, I, like, I, I have a, uh, I don't think it would be pleasant just to have something strapped literally to your head just uh -huh. to watch like a, like a two-hour movie uh -huh. on Netflix. Yo, but it's so lightweight though. Like that's the thing. Think well, about, lightweight, okay. but I mean, like the the with the 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 tether or the cords. Uh -huh. Yeah. Think about it though. You lay, back on, head. you lay back on a pillow, like this. Right. And you just like watch like this. You don't have to like crane your neck to look at the TV. You don't have to like worry about something getting in front of it. All you do is sit back, relax, and enjoy the film. Well, I guess because I, I can't really say much. I I haven't really uh, messed with. Well, I haven't, I haven't messed uh, with the with VR because, like, the only time was uh, was like uh, shortly after uh, Disney was uh, closing their doors on uh, Avalanche Software, you know, with Disney Infinity. Uh huh. Uh, I remember uh, one of the last few days uh, before it got closed. Like, I think I had a job interview somewhere in Salt Lake City. Uh huh. And uh, after that, my dad brought me to uh, Avalanche and he uh, took me to a buddy of his who had a VR headset and showed me some uh, some VR demos. Uh -huh. Like uh, one of them was, uh, well, I, th I think most of them were Disney thing. I think there was like some kind of Star Wars VR thing, but okay. it was like Star Wars, but like a s strategy chessboard kind of oh, I thing. I gotcha. Uh, and then there was another one where it was like Toy Story Mania, uh -huh. like the ride. I wonder, uh, yeah. That, and, oh, that's pretty sick. Yeah, and then there's one where um, uh, you are in this tank in uh, the Tron movie. Oh, cool, okay. Yeah, and you're shooting down these um, these um, Resler ships. Is that what they're called? I, I'm not uh, sure. You know, the, the, the black and red ones? Yeah, yeah. That's pretty sick. Okay. I, the only ones that, that, I've, yeah. that I've played were at your house when your dad was working for that VR company. Like the the one with Strata, the, yeah, 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 with the uh, with bows and arrows and stuff like that. Played those ones, um, but that's the only time I played it. But this one, it's just like, like I'm blown away. And like I said, I'm trying to decide on like what kind of game I want to get. Like, cause Caleb's got that, ah, shit. holy shit, that uh, Beat Saber game. He's got that one, and he really enjoys it. But I don't know. Run, bitch! Holy shit, that was close. Yeah, sneak attack! Well, you ain't one of those red guys. Don't creep up on me like that. I almost had it to tackle you there. Didn't mean to yell at you, but those red jerks moved in and have been sneaking up our turf, you know? They came up through that hole back there, so he sunk the road leading to in, in lava. That'll stop moving from moving in, I'd say. 
Of course we can tunnel underneath it. So it's no sweat for us. Pretty clever, right? So stay away from the plug that's holding back the lava. It'll do more than singe your bro brows off. Bye now. Bye. Okay, so I've got to... Uh... Bomb that? Yeah, I gotta grab some bombs. First up, I gotta blow up this plug here. I gotta run across. Alright, so I have to... Bowl this across? Ah, uh, really? Okay, well... Here's the thing, but I, I can't... Like, walk across it. Like, oh, you'll sink right away. Yeah. Fuck! Ah, oh, that sucks. Your ass was on fire there. Specifically, your asshole right there. All right. Make it. Make it. What the fuck? At the, at the last minute, like like the arrow turned to the right. It looked like. Okay. Well, that took a hot minute for the bomb to explode. I'm just. Okay. Yeah. It it turned as I try to <laughs> bullet. Yeah. Okay. Let's try this again. No. Ah, okay. Okay, quick question. Can I actually run? I cannot. Oh! oh. 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 Okay. <laughs> Throw that bitch uh. in the lava. Nope. Nope. Son of a bitch. Okay. That's a uh, dude at work's name for me. I think I've told you that. That's what he calls me. What? Son of a bitch. That's what his name is for me. His name? Uh, this dude. This dude. Uh, he. It's not on the the home unit that I work on. It's one that a unit that I've been pulled to. Like, uh, if they need staff or whatever. But like, so okay. So I I worked with this dude. Like it was like three nights in a row. Right. He was up all night hollering. You know, waking waking people up. Right, like, like waking up other people, other people were going off, being upset. So, you know, like, told him, I was like, hey man, you gotta go to bed. So, one of those nights, he, uh, he tried to hit the nurse. This is a while ago. He tried to, tried to hit the oh. nurse. Oh! Is that... No. Damn it! Close. Um, yeah, he tried, tried to hit the nurse. So, so we had to, um, had to be restrained and, and whatnot, but anywho, so Ooh. I was like, yo, I'm going to make sure this dude is like, th that he goes to bed. Like, Hey, he's got to, got to sleep. So like, he's a, he's a watch. So you have to like yeah. sit with him, like constantly for his own protection and the protection of others kind of thing. And, uh, so the whole time I was on his watch, he was telling me, I mean, this is after 11 o'clock at night, right? Right. So he's like, he's like talking to me and I'm just like, hey man, you should go to bed. For like an hour and a half, I'm just telling him like, hey man, you should go to bed. You look tired. You need to go to bed. Like just tell, tell him that, try to get him to, to go to sleep. Finally did it. But ever since then, whenever he sees me, he calls me, son of a bitch. Exactly like that. That's his name. Son of a bitch. I'm like, what's up? I... Uh, oh, oh, oh! That's it, that's it. Is it? Okay. Oh, thank, thank you. Fuck. There it goes. Oh. All right. I'll just, uh... Make my way across. You know what? Like... I know that, like, Nintendo's, like, really busy and shit, like, with the, uh, uh, with Breath of the Wild 2, but, 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 cheeks, cheeks and holes, uh, I really, really want a, uh, Zelda 3D All-Star on the Switch. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna happen. At least anytime soon. Then again, no one expected the uh, uh, Mario 3D All Stars. Oh, 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 oh. Right. Oh yeah, people were expecting it because they were like 
leaks about it. Uh huh. And uh, yet there were just like rumors of a Zelda 35th anniversary, and uh, nothing has surfaced from yeah. that. So the downside of people uh, looking up rumors or leaks of the game is that uh, they don't happen, and they get pissed off. Hey, can you knock like, that thing off of the wall? What? Like those uh, those shells, fossilized shells, or are they just there for decor? I think they're just there for decor. Oh, okay. Um, so, like, for example, the Switch OLED, mm -hmm. or OLED, uh, when that got announced, people were disappointed because it wasn't 4K. Yeah, but how are you... Yeah. I still think it's nice. Oh, okay, I'm trying to, like, get to all these platforms from top to Enter. bottom, so I don't have to make several trips. Oh, shit. Hold on. There it goes. <laughs> okay, um, next one down. Yeah, this is the highest platform, and I... There, was, there wasn't anything up there, was there? No. Uh, okay. Uh, then we got some... Bombs and a patch of... Weird patch of dirt. I think that's where one of the magmas show up. Okay. I think. Um... Can you use those bombs for anything? Do I need them for anything? I don't know, because I feel like you can't really jump down. Maybe that patch of dirt? I got a job dirt. I've got a job dirt! I've got a job dirt! Guess what's inside it? <laughs> I love uh, that. Yeah. Dude, I loved those movies. I thought those movies were like the shit. Yeah, the Pirates trilogy was yes. good. Four and five is like, man. Yeah, man. I, but, 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 but. Five leaves it on a cliffhanger that could potentially be awesome. But I thought, like, Davy Jones died. He fell into the ocean. Well, he also had his heart stabbed. Yeah. Yeah. But Calypso was down there, so she could have saved him. Well, no, Calypso, um, uh, I guess, faded away into an astral plane, I think. Uh -huh. So if all, so the results of all curses are gone, right? Spoiler for a movie that's like what, four years old, right? I mean, what was Calypso cursed with? Oh, no, she wasn't cursed with anything. She's just a, a, uh, a heathen goddess. Right. She was a, a goddess in disguise as a human. Right. That is correct. But, 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 but. Huh. Um, like, oh, yeah. What, so, no, I didn't mean to dive straight into this. The thing is, like, Clipso wasn't dead, she was just released. Yeah. So that's what I'm saying, like, like, uh, so, well, uh, Davy Jones was upset that, like, Calypso was, uh, released from the, this mortal coil. Mm -hmm. Therefore, like, you know, separating him, uh, separating him from her, mm -hmm. uh, even further, if that makes sense. But it's like, his last words are like, I'm coming, Calypso, or like, No, like, he just said, oh, Calypso. So he's like, he's like calling on her, and you think she's not gonna answer? Right? Right. Yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, that was just an enemy hiding there. Wow, what a bitch. And it's... It fell to its death. Gone. Huh. Okay, um... So, that was the way out. I guess I'll go this way now. Sweet. But, but yeah, so, like, at the very end of the fifth one, you get that, that cliffhanger. You've got uh, Will Turner's son and uh Barbosa's son or daughter they're going to Wait, Barbosa has a daughter? Yeah, yeah. Was that's, it, uh... that 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 chick that uh, Oh, the, right. The witch. Right, right. <laughs> the yeah. scientist, right? Like like she's a witch. I'm a scientist. You know, like that. Yeah. Man, people were so sexist back then. I think so. <laughs> uh, those creeps just shimmied on in and took over the our territory. Yeah, what are you doing? Don't be sneaking up on me like that. Huh? 
You're looking for your friend? Can't help you there. Nobody's come through here, so maybe they went up the mountain from over that away. Uh, I wish someone would chase these clowns out of here. Those scrawny clown snatch. <laughs> oh, it's got Mountain Dew up my nose. <laughs> oh, gosh. Scrawny. Gotta watch out for those uh, scrawny clown snatches. <laughs> All right. Oh, I got one more. Step. Come on. Come on. Cut. Come on. There, there's another one behind you too. Oh fuck. It's like, fuck you and your giant clubs! It's like I try to reposition to the opposite direction of their weapon and they just immediately... They just adapt to it. Yeah. Much of your controls, everybody. Yeah. I don't know, I think, uh... It's like... I think when, when oh, I... Oh, oh, oh! Ah. Uh. Like, I think, think when I play this on my Switch, it's all gonna be, like, handheld mode, so... So you're gonna do buttons only? Oh, yeah. Just remember that, like, if you do that, if you want to rotate the camera, you're gonna have to hold L. Oh, yeah, that's alright. But, uh, also, that, uh, to attack, you're also gonna have to use uh, the right stick. Oh, yeah. So, the right stick is to attack, and then... Oh, wait, there's a... Ah, this fucker. That's actually calling in for backup. I gotta kill this mofo. Knock him off the... Stab him in the... His mouth. Stab him in the dick! Grab his dick and twist it! Grab his dick and twist it! Oh gosh, that's spectacular. Oh, dang it, I want to lock on to the other guy. Okay, I got a regular oh, nice. skull. I think it's different from the gold one? Yeah. yeah. Whoa! You took out every last one of them! Yes. Oh yeah, I did! Okay. Is there, uh... Nothing else up here? It was just... Yeah, I didn't see anything. Okay. Um, there is a chest up there. Just hide places that I can't reach. You're one tough customer! Thanks for all your help! I don't blame you for not knowing this, but us Magmas always under our debts. Let me give you something to prove it. Any special requests? Um... A way forward. Oh, right, you're trying to find your friend, aren't you? In that case, take these things! There's something pretty special if I say so myself. Hey, digging mitts. Yeah, I can use them to... Uh, dig through patches of soft earth. Yes, that's a term. Soft earth, not soft dirt. Soft earth. Soft earth. Man, just imagine if earth was just made out of fabric. That'd be so weird. It's like, uh, it's like I gotta go. I gotta go dig a hole. You grab a pair of scissors. <laughs> <laughs> like, um, say, imagine Pillow World from uh, Adventure Time. Holy shit. Yeah, you can get some, like... Uh, have you not seen Adventure Time? No. Uh, but I think I know what you're talking about. I think I've seen clips. Okay, so there... So, um... So the premise is that, like... Finn is, a uh, Okay, so... Jake and Bima are building, like, a huge pillow fort in their treehouse. Uh-huh. Finn's kind of down because he told his girlfriend at the time, Flame Princess, like, a joke one day, and, uh, she didn't laugh. Uh-huh. Uh, and then... Uh, Finn is like overthinking about it. it's like oh, I guess uh, things are over between us and then I'm gonna I'm gonna go do some thinking in the, the pillow fort and then for, uh, so, for some random reason uh, Finn gets like deeper and deeper and then finds a door in the wall and then opens it and like there's a whole world just made out of pillows like basically like Narnia <laughs> Essentially, yeah, nice. it, it is like a Narnia episode. Oh, cool, kinda, okay, kind of thing. All right, that's but fun. with pillows. Nice, but even like Finn gets super old and then dies, 
And yet it comes back to life uh, in his uh, original age kind of thing. So he's, so he's lived a lifetime in there. That's crazy. Uh, okay, be sure to try digging with A anywhere. You see a sign that something very soft the ground. Okay. With these, you should be able to get to the top of the ledge right behind me. Just try digging that hole below the ledge. You're in for a surprise. I just hope your friend hasn't been captured by those red guys. He's hoping everything's okay. All right. Oh, is it just uh, a pouch thing? Oh, no, I guess it's just an automatic thing huh. that I could just do. Hang on. Was there any uh, patches of dirt? Oh, yes, there is. All right, cool. So I could just, like, walk up to it. Oh, that's nice. Hold on. You keep digging. Wow. That is handy. Yeah. <laughs> no pun intended. Oh, <laughs> okay. I, it I was see, no I pun intended. I, I, I see I what said, you did I there. I said it, and then it, like, occurred to me, and then I felt bad. All right. Um, I need to get over here. So there's... There's a... So I'm under here. Oh! Okay, I, I see where this is. So it's uh, that first room I fell into. Yes. There were two patches of dirt. I see. So the one I want to get to is... Um... Oh, wait. Oh, no. It has nothing to do with that other room. It's um outside here. Okay. Okay, so I got to take this... Middle path, I think. The other two are just there. All right, I'll keep that in mind. So take the middle oh. path. So, oh, so I was gonna, I was gonna tell you something. So, uh, a while ago, years ago, uh, Jacob and I came up with an idea for a TV show. Uh, Bohorquez. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, is this uh da fuck? Da fuck. Okay, Tanner. On Netflix. It, have, we, have we ever talked about it? I don't think we have. Okay. But... Just, just be aware that someone might take your idea. No, they already did. Oh? They did? Not the, not the name, but... But the, 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 con the concept premise. of the show? Yes. So, it's on Netflix. Made by Netflix. It's called America the Motion Picture. Um, I've never heard of that. Holy shit. It was hilarious. Is it a live action film or is no, it an animation? It's, a, it's an animation. Oh, perfect. Which is, which is what we, like, because while we were making it, or while we were thinking about it, we didn't know what kind of animation to use. And, like, like I was telling Jacob about it, like, we wa I watched it, and I was like, dude, the whole, like, like, it's our idea, but, like, a little, it, it's, like, tweaked, right? It's kind of, it's like an action uh, uh, show about like America's founding fathers and like other like other stuff like you have like Abraham Lincoln you've got like um like like all kinds of stuff in there where it's like it's funny but it's also like actiony like over the top actiony like George Washington's like jacked like huge or something like that yeah and so we had we had come up with this with this idea just want to see um, if there's which I, I still think we could I still think we could we could use because you could turn it into a, a series but because that's what we wanted it to be we wanted it to be a, a show or like like a TV show and so uh, like in this one uh, Abraham Lincoln and uh, George Washington are like best friends right or whatever and it, I'm not gonna spoil it you need to watch it it's really funny your mom won't like it. <laughs> so, uh, what's uh, what's the art style? I, I I'm kind of curious now. I mean, kind I mean, can, can, can can you Google it or? Yeah, I can I can show you. Ooh, hello. Whoa, you scared me silly. You can't just start digging right above my head, you know. But I get where you're coming from. You never know what you're gonna going to find when you dig. So it's impossible to stop. Rupees are the most common treasure you'll dig up. But sometimes you might even score Elden or, or some hearts. So if you run across a hole. And you've got the time. Dig, dig, dig. All right. Dig, 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 indeed. All right. Can't go there. Ooh, hello. Okay. So it's almost anime-esque. It's like... Oh, it's not anime. But, uh... So, yeah, wait till there's, like... 
Oh, wait, does it get more anime? Yeah. yeah. Let's skip ahead. Oh, so much blood. Oh, yeah. Wow. Oh, yeah, it's a fucking mess. So all, all like it's it's got its own its own animation. Style, okay, like. definitely action. Yeah, but holy now, shit! Now I've never seen uh, this show on Netflix, so don't at me, dude. Um, I want to say it kind of looks like the Castlevania I, I animation. Think, I think that's accurate. But holy shit! So like, all right. So our idea was that there's a uh, a mad scientist that creates a time machine, right, and is going and fucking up history. So, um, uh, so the United States decides to go and get, uh, like, make their own time machine, go back in time and collect all of America's heroes to, uh, to fight this, this, uh, evil scientist that's trying, trying to fuck up history, right? Like, like, like make, like, just cha change things, right? So you get, uh. You've got like Martin Luther King Jr. You've got uh, <laughs> George Washington. You've got uh, Abraham Lincoln. You've got um, like like there, there's a couple there's a couple others. No, I think that was the, that was pretty much it. But so we uh, we uh, well we want and then some random Mexican dude named Juan who ha always has a chicken with him and he calls it his cock. <laughs> or a rooster. It's like it's like say hello to my little it, friend. It's, it's like it's like it's like it's like one. You can't can't take your chicken with me. No, it's my cock. Right? Like like you just have like uh, a no, whole it is my joke. cock. Like a whole a whole joke with that. Like like uh, Jacob and I thought that would be pretty funny. But the uh, nice. Uh, but yeah. So uh, this one, it's it's less like that. Like they don't have like some kind of like mad scientist like gathering people up. But there's a lot of uh, uh, people like that are that are there, but it's it's really funny. Yeah. Like I I really liked it. I told Jago, I was like I'm not even really mad, <laughs> but still want to. Uh, maybe what I'll do is I'll finish. Ooh. Nice, uh, right in there. Ooh. Uh. Maybe maybe what I'll do is I'll finish the script for it and try to sell it to Netflix for a million dollars. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Go. Pride. I'm curious to see what will happen. Oh yeah. Um, well, it's just just like like being over the top, you know, just like crazy. It's like you've got um, because because like I don't know. Especially right now, it's kind of I don't know. It kind of poke, pokes fun at everything because um, like every, everyone's saying, oh yeah, the founding founding fathers are racist or whatever, right? Like they they had slaves. And yeah, yeah, they did. Right, but uh, honestly, you know, it's like the 1700s who didn't, but like the uh, so like like kind of kind of getting into into those kind of things. Like you've got uh, a lot of like like discussions that are that are even like like making like making fun of them for that. You know, it's like oh well, you, so you couldn't do your own fucking laundry kind of thing. Like like those kind of those kind of things are in there, and like that, that you can laugh at. It's like satire. But right, um, yeah. The uh, I told Jacob I'm gonna finish. I'm gonna finish working on the. Oh damn page. it! Can you just send your beetle in there? Um, uh, I'll probably just stun it. You know, wouldn't I, have time to get the. I mean, I, I could try. I have to send get super, to the beetle, but I, I, I have to get super low to the ground. Damn bitch! No, that didn't do yeah, anything. I, yeah, no. Can your beetle pick up a bomb and carry it in there? Uh, it can, actually. Wait. Oh, I got it. Yeah. Yay! But yeah, uh, so so I told Jay, I'm, I'm going to finish I'm going to finish the script. I'm going to finish working on it. And then uh um then try to sell it to Netflix. Yeah, the ooh, ooh, that was close. Uh, the art style I was singing about that would go well with the fuck uh -huh. is either um, obviously Rick and Morty, uh huh, um, or do like the regular show slash close enough art style. Okay, I I, I like it. Well, and the, well, because we wanted uh, at the time we were watching uh, Art Archer, 
a lot and we like that art style but it's but even that is its own like kind of art style and so we're like well we don't want to copy it you know right because because archer you know in a lot of ways it's like it's like over the top did i even bother with um wait did i come out from this way where where am i oh wait no this is yeah that's where you came in okay yeah i talked with that guy i'm getting lost in here uh, it's this way I want to go nice. to. Nice. Okay. But yeah, so, I mean, so we were watching Archer a lot, and, like, it also has its own uh, art style, kind of comic book-esque, like, in a lot of ways. So, like, we didn't want to just copy that. Right. And uh, we also didn't want it to be, like, too cartoony, like, like Family Guy. Because we wanted it to be that, and that's why that that art style, the castle, like that kind of art style, was perfect. Like that's the the thing is like, I mean, I think uh, like and the whole thing is over the top. Like the the whole that whole movie is just is wild the whole time. Right. And, and like like I said, I'm not even mad because I mean it's it's a it's a good idea and it, and it's funny. Didn't you say that there was one scene where? I don't know. It, it was something to do with like a really buff George Washington or something. Uh huh. And uh, there's a uh, what like a Mexican Mexican kid just like I don't know having a treat in, in the yes uh, yeah in yeah the park that, yeah and, the, and, uh, and uh, but the George Washington is like going after a squirrel instead or something. Yeah. Uh huh. And so uh, he uh, uh, George Washington somehow shoots out like this uh, American beam. Yeah. Uh, at the squirrel, but also with this a uh, Mexican kid in the way. <laughs> yeah, and get, the the kid gets kid gets hit and gets his citizenship immediately. <laughs> like, like like that kind of, like that kind of shit. Like I just kind of caught the caught the cross crosshairs or whatever. Yeah, but yeah, oh, man. Yeah, so uh, well, Jacob. Yeah, because uh, uh, Jacob and I we thought of that that pilot like together. The. Uh, the rest of the season we're still working on, but I mean, it's been years since we worked on it. I've still got the script though. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. That's one of the few things I didn't delete on my laptop before we started recording. Um, I would strongly advise to, well, I don't know how because I've never done this myself, but try to like, uh, get your idea copyrighted or patented so that way no one can steal it. Oh yeah. Yeah. I mean, uh. Uh, I mean, I, I would strongly urge you to do it before this episode comes up because uh, someone could easily take your idea oh, yeah. and say it's theirs. That's true. But uh, otherwise, like, people can watch this episode and be like, Hey, the the guy who created the fuck! He didn't create the fuck! He stole this guy's idea! Hey, there you go, yeah. See, there you go. So well, there... It, wouldn't, it wouldn't even be the fuck. Like, like, that was just a, kind of our working title. Oh, okay. Like, but the, uh, um... Like like this la that that one on Netflix, America the Motion Picture is fucking great. Oh, wasn't, wasn't there like another scene where um, so so like all the what the the father figures like George uh -huh. Washington, Abe Lincoln, uh huh, and um, uh, do they uh, did you say something that they were flying some kind of spaceship that looked like a dick or or no that was the, the dictators the dictators yes yeah <laughs> they were the dicks <laughs> it's like the, the uh, dicks le led by uh, Adolf Hitler yeah le led by Adolf Hitler who's flamboyantly gay like so gay that like the other dictators are really uncomfortable working with him <laughs> yeah, it's like hi you know? <laughs> <laughs> it's like snail <laughs> you know like, like saying shit like that and they're they're like like like. <laughs> Okay, everything, buddy. Let's go. <laughs> can I get in the back? Oh, I can get in the front. I like it both ways. <laughs> you know, like that. Like, and they're all like, "Oh man, you have to make it weird." <laughs> like, oh, I'm, I'm going. I want to buy surprise. If I buy surprise, what? What? Everyone, uh, get buy the. Sh should we all share fries? Should we share fries? I think like, we're, like, we're gonna share some fries. Wearing like leader hose in there, like all the way up, to, like crunched up, like showing his whole like grundle. Oh, <laughs> like, like just like that, like the whole thing. And he, like, we were gonna make, like, Hitler flamboyantly gay. Like, like, like I said, to the point where the other dictators... Well, is is, is he gay just together. because of uh, this one guy was, like, messing with time travel too much? Uh, no, it's just that he uh, traveled from there to this time and realized that being gay is okay. And so he decided to let all of his inhibitions go. <laughs> we're saying that he was gay back then. Right. Because, <laughs> I mean, like, it, it's just, <clears throat> it, it's making fun of the dude. And right. it was like really 
really fun. Just just because of how uncomfortable he makes the other dictators because they're not quite as progressive as Hitler in that way. <laughs> right. And so they're like, no, no, it's it's not okay. Yes, it is. Have you been like 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 he's like, haven't you been to twenty twenty one or whatever or twenty when we're right we're like right now like I've been to gay bar, gay bar son? Oh, nice. <laughs> they, they, are, they are nice. Do do you not like my leader Hosen? <laughs> and like like we're talking like the, the scrunched up leader Hosen. And especially uh um like uh what was it? Kim Jong un, I think that's Kim Yeah. Yeah. North, especially uh, North Korea. especially the North Korean dictator. He's like hard no on the gay shit. <laughs> right? Like he's just like so angry about it. And then like later on in the and, season And then just launches a nuke and all the gays. Well well he's so later on in the season, we were going to have like Hitler finally seduce him <laughs> and then just like have like a whole like romance arc with them. Oh, just man. Like, like the other dictators there's walking on them everywhere. If that happens, if that gets on the internet, there's going to be so much rule 34 shit. I don't know what that is. Oh, you don't know? Oh, the, oh, the everything that shows up on the internet can oh, okay. be turned into porn. Any, okay, if it exists on the internet, there's porn of it. Yeah, but who's going to watch Hitler and Kim Jong Un porn? Like, who's going to be into that? <laughs> It's like it's like oh yeah I'm gonna murder your family oh yeah I'm gonna murder like he's just like a terrible there, human being. I think it's safe to assume that when you ask, but who would watch this or who would do this? I think it's safe to assume that there's going to be at least one person. Oh yeah, hey, good for you, buddy. Whoa, now there's a green one. That's whatever you want. <laughs> <laughs> I don't give a shit.